right, good morning if you're just waking up. Well, it's Tuesday and we're just a few days out from Halloween. So I know we have to get through some rain chances before we get there, but <laughs> just there give it to go. me. There you go. Go ahead I and give them now, the forecast. <laughs> now the yes. new meteorologist. <laughs> some rain chances ahead as we get into late week, maybe the first part of the weekend, but we're not talking like a washout event. And then temperatures remaining on the pleasant side. And I tell you what, Halloween forecast is looking pretty good. So we'll talk about that here in just a couple minutes. Well, let's take you back to yesterday. What a beautiful fall day it was. Some of the photos I got sent in on my WYMT Facebook page. Uh, Crystal from Pike County. Nice uh, sunshot here. You can see blue skies. We had lots of it and lots of sunshine to go along with those pleasant conditions yesterday afternoon. And then as we get into the evening hours, I could just sit back and enjoy this view for hours. Obviously, it wouldn't last that long, but I tell you what, a nice shot there from Mary over in Pike County and then another view showing more of the same. And you talk about just a beautiful evening out there, and I hope you're able to get out and enjoy it. And I have some good news. If you enjoyed yesterday, well, today will be very similar. We're starting out nice and dry, a little on the cold side, but that's okay because temperatures warming back up. Pinpoint Doppler this morning, no rainfall to speak of. That's because high pressure spinning just to our north and northwest, giving us those winds more from the north and northeast. That's pulling in some chillier air. And when you look at some of the temperatures across the board this morning, we're dropping into the mid even upper 30s across southern and eastern parts of the state. So some patchy frost, certainly a possibility as you hit the road this morning. Bus stop forecast for the kids, long sleeve shirt, the light coat. That is best early on. Temperature around 40 degrees, making for that chilly start. And of course, it's cooler in some other valley areas where we're dropping into the mid 30s. But all in all, we're back into the mid 60s. Everyone is a little bit later on this afternoon, and you guessed it, more sunshine expected with those pleasant temperatures. An average high should be at 66 degrees. That's exactly where we top out today. So a seasonable day ahead as we make it through this afternoon. Future view as we kick it off at 7 o'clock this evening. There are some changes on the way. Remember, I was just talking about some of those rain chances that arrive later on this week. Well, first, we'll see a warm front lift from the southwest pushing towards the north and east. That allows winds to shift more from the south and southwest. Remember what that does. It pulls in some warmth from the Gulf of Mexico. That's going to allow us to warm up. In fact, we reached the lower 70s for highs until Wednesday afternoon. Mostly sunny skies expected, but notice what happens. Cloud cover quickly begins to increase from the north and west. And then here comes this cold front that brings some rain chances across central and eastern Kentucky as we wake up early Thursday morning. And that will continue into the first part of Thursday afternoon as this frontal boundary begins to push south and eastward. It eventually clears eastern Kentucky as we get into Thursday night, but cloud cover that will stick around through late Thursday night, early Friday. And then we're expecting to go mostly sunny as we wake up for your Friday afternoon, Friday morning, and I should say until we get into your Friday afternoon. Now, as far as temperatures are concerned, remember I said an average high is at 66 degrees. Well, we are above that as we make it through the next five days. But overall, talk about just a nice stretch of weather. We'll have to deal with a few rain chances along the way, but it's nothing too crazy. Nothing washout uh, level like I was talking about. So that's the good news. The next chance for rain, perhaps Saturday, maybe just a stray shower. Most of us stay dry. Temperatures around 70 degrees. And look at that Halloween forecast. Mostly sunny skies expected temperatures topping out around 70 degrees. That will make for a perfect evening to do some trick or treating. Let's get a check of the refrigerator art this morning. See what we have behind the magnets. Love showcasing all the wonderful artwork from the kids here across Eastern Kentucky. Nice photo sent in from Ava over at Osborne Elementary. All right, Osborne Elementary. <laughs> it's time now for 